I need to check the workshop because apparently PUBG finally re-released the corrected workshop crate probability. So let's go take a look real quick. All right, so workshop uh, crate probabilities have supposedly been updated and fixed. Let's go check, check them out. So store, view items, hunter's chest, uh, F to view probabilities. Yes, okay, perfect. So I am, uh, I'm gonna record this and upload this. But I'll, I'll try to like maybe screenshot or, or get a PDF list or something of all these. Can you copy paste? No, dang. I'm going to see if I can get like a, a PDF version of this so that we can just control, you know, F search through it. Because a lot of y'all ask for very specific items. Um, and you know, I, obviously I won't, I won't know for sure unless I search the list. Or now you can search the list uh, easily as well just by logging in. Um, and I'll show you, make sure I show you how to do that again. So you just go to the store. You can't go to the workshop, go to the store. Go to Hunter's Chest, hit F to view probabilities, and then click on each of these little drop down doodads. And there's different items in there with their percentages in there as well. So this one is costume and gear imprints. Imprints are um, the items that you need in conjunction with the little co uh, coins to make the imprint. These are individual items. So uh, I, I'm not, again, I'm not going to go through these because look, I mean, look at the list. It's, incredibly long but you you get the idea um there's a lot of items in there and they're tiered so legendary then it goes to epic uh then it goes to elite and is that the highest one rare is the highest one and special which are like uh, only limited uh time items that come out with like let's say a new map drops or a special mode comes out or something like that uh, then they have classic, which like kind of the more everyday stuff. And, uh, the, everything ironically is 0.049%. That's odd to me that every item, regardless of its, um, specialty for lack of a better word is the same percentage. I guess, I guess it's a good thing though. It's better than, um, you know, the really cool items being like a silly low percentage, but, uh, there you go. So, so there you go. Uh, now what this percentage means too, in case you haven't watched my full video going over the workshop where I actually opened up like a hundred dollars worth of crates, I'll link that video above you or in the description below. Uh, feel free to go check that out. What this says is 50% chance of every time you open up this crate that you will get a singular costume or gear imprint. There's a 30% chance that you'll get a set imprint. A set imprint is uh, still a costume item, but it's when it has multiple items inside of it. So like a safari set would be like the hat, the shirt, the pants, and the shoes. Whereas a safari shirt may only come in the costume imprint up here. Okay. And then here again, you can see the percentages, uh, all the items available 0.155. So there's a higher percentage that you'll get these items but there's a lower overall percentage that it'll be selected of the list of things to get, if that makes sense. Uh, emote imprints. Some of these are probably teams. Yeah, so some are victory dances, some are regular emotes. Um, and they have, you know, PGC stuff in there, PCS stuff in there. So some potentially really cool things to get in there. Uh, vehicle vouchers. I really like the vehicle vouchers personally. Um, number one, I don't have a ton of vehicle skins. Number two, the vouchers mean that you don't need any coins to craft the item. A voucher is like a coupon that says you unlock this item if you choose to do so. And there's a bunch of them in there. Uh, PCS stuff, PGC stuff, the 8-bit Roni, one of my favorites. So yeah, some cool stuff in there. Uh, then a nameplate and spray voucher and 150 credits. Credits is what you need to actually craft the item uh, from the imprint. And then this is a uh, bonus content. So you have a 10% chance that another hunter's chest will be inside of your current hunter's chest, which is cool. 3.5% chance that you'll get 10 artisan tokens, which are needed to unlock the premium um, crafting items. And then lastly, uh, you have a 0.5% chance that you'll get epic or legendary costume and gear voucher again this is voucher for a uh instant you get it item you don't need any coins to craft it okay and so in there you can click that and it's going to be uh the whole list of stuff 0.005 percent of what you're going to get uh so there you go
And then we're going to go check out the other chest too. So the archivist chest. Let's see if this one has anything different. Uh, so this one has a higher percent chance of getting set imprints. So not individual items. So that's good. Uh, and I think the items in here are, are better too, right? Let's see. That was my computer, guys. Um, lazy. I just want to see if these are duplicated. So like this one has a activist, law, Le Leon's, Taurus, striped, and pajama, lazy. Okay, let me go see if any of those are in here. For the legendary. Special, special, special. No, okay. What about up here? Where's the special, special, special? I'm just trying to see if they're both in the same crate or if one crate has actual different items than the other. A special. Uh, here we go. Okay, go, 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 go. Activist, wait, was, was that the same thing? Activist top. I don't think that was the same thing. Uh, oh, Lawan's, oh, Lawan's pants though. So was the other one pants too? So that's Lawan's pants. And I don't see the other one. So it does look like they have different items. Let's go back one more time and then go click here again. Special. The one set. Oh, it's oh duh, because this is the set and not just individual items. Yeah. So, okay. So I, there you go. I did answer my own question. The, uh, these do have more in different items, but also the entire sets of items. Whereas the other crate has only some of the individual items in a particular set. So that's good. Uh, vehicle voucher. This seems like it has more vehicles than the other one. Um, I think that's about the same nameplate and sprays and then uh, costume and gear voucher. I think that's the same as the other one though. Just maybe a higher percentage. So there you go. Uh, so that's all the items in the um, workshop hunters and the archivist chest. Again, if you want to know like really how this whole system works, how to craft it, how to uh, salvage your items, what's the best way to do all that. Go watch my other video where I went over literally all that stuff in very, very, very good detail. And I, I spent a lot of my own money getting a lot of this stuff to show you. So again, that video will be up top or in the description below. And uh, yeah, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share it with the buddy and get subscribed for more PUBG content. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.